Um, so like I said, the therapeutic level to reverse insulin resistance is basically doing alternate day fasting. So adding in two 36 to 42 hour fasts every week. So again, people are like, Oh, you know, my sister is one of them. She's pretty severe insulin resistance and she struggles. And I'm like, okay, this is what you need to do. Like you have stubborn insulin resistance. You need to add in two 36 hour fasts a week. I think she's doing 16 to 18 most, most days, which is great but it's not going to help you turn the corner with stubborn insulin resistance. So a 36 hour fast would be not eating all day and then sleeping. So a lot of people get used to not eating until around lunchtime. So then they're like, well, I woke, I wake up. I don't ever eat breakfast. I'm not hungry in the morning. I'm just going to extend it till lunchtime. And that's where that 42 hour fast comes in. Um, so adding in two 36 to 42 hour fast every week is called the therapeutic level to reverse insulin resistance. Almost always works with reversing prediabetes and diabetes, type two diabetes. I should mention if you have either of those diagnoses and you're on medications, you need to, to talk with your physician. I can't help you with coming off insulin or medications. That's something that you need to, you need help with, um, from your practitioner. Um, but it definitely, if you're starting this, have a conversation like now, because you will need to reduce medications really quickly and insulin really quickly, which is a good thing. I mean, people come off their insulin within a month of doing this. I mean, it's crazy. It's, it's amazing. Um, but this is the therapeutic level. So if you've been doing fasting for a long time, or you've been doing OMAD and you're just feeling kind of stuck, this is the next step for you. Like, and a lot of you are like, oh my gosh, I'm really overwhelmed right now. Like there is no way I can do this. Something that you want to work up to, but this, if you listen to Jason Fung, Megan Ramos, all of the leaders in the, in the really re using fasting as a therapeutic nutritional approach, this is what, and I've, I've gone through the, the, um, additional training for therapeutic carb restriction. And this is the therapeutic approach to really reverse metabolic disease.